What is this flow? Goldilocks did it. Yeah, what's good y'all? If you're new to the channel, my name is Shadiq and I act in the crossover media. I was super gassed when I saw this one teased. T-Way is one of my personal favorite UK artists. When I reacted to his project early in the year with Frank, make sure you check that one out by the way, I got some of my favorite songs for the year off of that project. So you know what, I'm also let y'all know, I just recently made my intro to T-Way playlist public on my Spotify account. I'm having links somewhere up here in the cards. If you wanna hear what I think of some of T-Way's best songs, and if you wanna introduce people to T-Way's music, check out that playlist. I arranged all of these intro playlists to feel like a project. So I've really been having a really good time listening to this one. I've actually been rinsing it lately. So the fact that this one has been dropping in the midst of be listening to those tracks. It's been very timely. I also want to say really quickly, shout out to the team over at Plugged In for sending this video out to me early. I want to get this one edited and out as soon as possible for y'all. I already know t is going to spin it. He's one of my favorite artists. Yo. His wordplay is sick. His beat selections are usually really sick. So I don't want to hold y'all too much longer. Let's get it. Fumes, the engineer. Come oh, peace. Oh. Through the fifth, Come through the on, fucking guys. guys. TF shit. TF shit. Come on, guys. It was up. Strong with them niggas. Bow. I'm already enjoying this beat so far. I haven't really been feeling the plugged in beats lately. This beat right here. I can see how this melody might be a bit awkward for some people though. So much holes, no man woke up soaked, he probably leaking still. Ten floors up, three cats and a vandal, all of them know how needles feel. Them traps with me shots in conscious. Fumes, the engineer. Oh, peace. Through the fifth, through the fucking guys. TF shit. Come on, guys. It was up. Strong with them niggas. Ooh, I just caught that su that sample is cold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This 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 producer's funny. So much holes, no man woke up soaked, he probably leaking still. Ten floors up, three cats in a vandal, all of them know how needles feel. M traps with me shots in country, I swing shots back like Serena Will. I told Baba S get a music. Fumes, the engineer. Come on, peace. Through the fifth, through That's the what I like hands. about T. Yeah, like, the TF shit. Oh he God. layers the Those stories with the wordplay. Man said, send shots back like Serena will. Like, he send shots back. Like Serena, so much holes, no man woke up soaked, he probably leaking still. Ten floors up, three cats and a vandal, all of them know how needles feel. M traps swing me shots in country, I swing shots back like Serena will. I told Baba S get a music check on bro, said I don't even need a deal. 300 stones and moats with S, this old school Persia ain't got no sap, now slap that stainless steel in his snap back. Now the boat boys banging on Snapchat, pull up and slap. No J pull up and slap, that niggas get cooked like flapjacks, ops got. What is this flow? This is, I don't care what any of y'all say, this is already probably about to go into my top five plugged ins. Off rip, this off my initial impression. T Way, he's too cold, like. He said send shots to the snapback. Alright, because it looks like looks like he's wearing a fitted, but in fact he said send shots to the snapback. Like the ways that people articulate stunning headshots, right? Like send it to your cap at your wig, at your hat, like all those things, like. Just stones and moats with S, this old school Persia ain't got no sap. Now slap that stainless steel in his snap back. Now the boat boys banging on Snapchat, pull up and slap. No J, pull up and slap. That niggas get cooked like flapjacks. Ops got PTSD from dingers. And they don't wanna see M in map black laser beam on the nose and a whap like Halo. Cuz grab that when I say so. Pirates flow with a lake called Joe's and a main road car. He bands on a. Does Say So have a song called Halo? I feel. I don't know. Maybe he does, maybe he doesn't. I don't know, but I feel like. I don't know. Let me, let, me, let me not even try to reach too far. They're dope. 300 stones and moats with S. This old school Persia ain't got no sap. Now slap that stainless steel in his snap back. Now the boat boys banging on Snapchat. Pull up and slap. Lil J pull up and slap. That niggas get cooked like flapjacks. Ops got PTSD from dingers. And they don't wanna see M in Mac Black. Laser beam on the nose and a whap like Halo. Cuz grab that when I say so. Pirates fill with a Lake or Jaws on a main road. Carty bands on a Draco. Junkies shagging on sofa beds. Free tough knock on the door. That's plain clothes gang. My bad, y'all. I had to go get a package just now. If y'all heard my bell ring, let's run this back a little bit because I already forgot what made me react like that. So I'm gonna run this back a little bit. Oh, I know what I was gonna say. Band no living, I'm shattered. I'm waking up to the junkie shagging. Like the stories that T Way tells and the way that he tells it, like he says things that are so memorable. It doesn't have to be these like somewhat forced, hey, I'm giving you the punchline. It's supposed to feel like a punchline. Hey, I'm so clever. Like he says things that are just like, 
that's from a real experience. Like, that isn't something you just sat down and, and just thought about, you know, from your imagination. That's what I like about T-Way. That stainless store in his snapback. Then I bought boys banging on Snapchat. Pull up and slap. Lil J pull up and slap. That niggas get caught like flapjacks. Ops got PTSD from fingers. And they don't want to see M in Mac Black. Laser beam on her nose and a whap like Halo. Cause grab that when I say so. Pirates feel with a Laco. Jaws on a main road. Carty bands on a Draco. Junkies shagging on sofa beds. Free tough knock on the door. That's plain clothes. Gang them blue but up. Get soaked. Three knocking on doors. That's plain clothes. Junkies shagging on so for beds, free tough knock on the door that's plain clothes, gang and blue but up, get soaked in red, and they ain't got a choice to say no retail shops in a brand new country, shining seaside, traveling islands, niggas so dumb if you ain't gave racks to your bros or mum, why you wearing diamonds? We're singing this shanker now on that day, there's a minute of silence, frontline country coming like Harlem 80s, hammers on coke and sirens, and the way that it goes is mad. I know he, he's saying so freaking much, yo, you know what? I think I understand why Wax and I typically tend to gravitate towards the rappers who have more of the trap sound. Something about the way that they articulate themselves is it, just a little bit more creative. I think maybe it's because like their experiences, like obviously like they're incriminating in their own way, but they aren't like super heavily incriminating as like people who are primarily like on drill drill, like the GM. So they're able to give a little bit more insight into their life, and their stories are things that they could say a little bit more freely to a degree. You know what I mean? So, so I think that's one of the reasons why artists like T Wave, Fizzler. T Zandos, like those kinds of artists, they just always have so much to say. Cause they have stories for days that they can kind of say. You feel me? Seeing no retail shops in a brand new country, shining seaside, traveling islands. Niggas so dumb if you ain't gave racks to your bros or mom, why you wearing diamonds? If you ain't gave racks to your bros or your mom, why you wearing diamonds? These are, but you know, I get it though. I understand from from the perspective of people who probably grow up not having. I, under I grew to understand rather why once you get why it becomes some so much of a compulsion to the splurge. I, I, I understand that a little bit more, but he's right. Like, once you get that bread, especially if you're from a certain circumstance, you got to make sure everybody around you is good. And if you don't have enough to get you out of that situation, all you're doing is making yourself a target too. So, there's that. I travel in islands, niggas so dumb if you ain't gave racks to your bros or mom while you wearing diamonds. Was singing this shanker now on that day. There's a minute of silence. Frontline country coming like Harlem 80s. Hammers on coke and sirens. And a weird. Now on that day, there's a minute of si Again, there's things that T Way says that are just so quotable, bruh. T Way is probably one of the most quotable artists in the UK. I don't even want to say in drill. Like, obviously, the sound that he does is primarily like on drill beats, but I don't want to just classify him as a drill rapper. He's just one of the most quotable people. Like I've ever encountered. It is a minute of silence, frontline country coming like Harlem 80s, hammers on coke and sirens. And the way that it goes is mad. So you talking about Harlem, New York? You talking about Harlem, New York? Then that's cool. Frontline country coming like Harlem 80s, hammers on coke and sirens. And the way that it goes is mad. Niggas get smoked and trapped in a goo like new my man way before the war. I try to leave dead like two pack aunties, text my phone, come back. I'm on the way back trying to reload new crack aunties, dressed in puma, banging my door. I'm asking, how could I do that? And we trips on the most with fiends. They're telling me. I get it. That's one of the things I also like, like, he has these motifs, like, things that he brings back in every song, like, references to conversations with his mother, and he always does it in slightly more unique ways every time, too, like, Mumsy's saying, how could you do that? It's like these, these lines that just sit with you. <sighs> oh, man. Dead like said Tupac, on these texts my phone come back I'm on the way back trying to reload new crap On these dressed in puma, banging my door I'm asking how could I do that yeah. N-way trips on the most with fiends They're telling me all their broken dreams Pussy your ups ain't got no heart How you just left your brothers to bleed I'm in a Volvo with poles on me I decap the ride nearly broke I'm in a Volvo hey, Listen to the part, like the, the way that the, the freaking beat matched it, yo I always point those out because I, I love it when they do that And R.I.P. to I believe that name says Patch on his hat Got no heart, how you just left your brothers to bleed I'm in a Volvo with poles on me I decap the ride nearly broke my knee Gave in a chin lap Wait, hold on, hold on, I'm so, I know I'm pausing a lot Sorry, it's a reaction video, get over it But the way he went from matching the bass line, the kick, to immediately matching the hi-hats, peep it, yo, peep it. They're telling me all their broken dreams. Pussy your ups ain't got no heart. How you just left your brothers to bleed? I'm in a Volvo with poles on me. I decamped the ride, nearly broke my knee. Gave in a chin lap. I don't know how your broken breathe. And CO2's all over the sleeve. I fire man Sam, then I step to west. Four for smoke for the gold men too. Now the golden bells in my man's. Old 15, I was taking a piss. I never went conch, but I kept the pens. Golden bells stuck in the door. The beam of car door intercepted death. On my vet shit, I put life for the homeless cats. Cause he. You said he intercepted death? What? Hold on. Bells in my man's. Old 15, I was taking a piss. I never went conch, but I kept the pens. Golden bells stuck in the door. The beam of car door intercepted death. On my vet shit, I put life for the homeless cats. Cause he.
got bag with a whip and I can't put trust in a pig. But life in the homeless cat. Taking a piss, I never went conch, but I kept the pens. Golden bills stuck in the door, the beam of car door intercepted death. On my vet shit, I put life in the homeless cats, cause he got bag with a whip and I can't put trust in a pagan bitch. I'd rather trust peas that life for the crap. I wrap this rent in an X5 chase me. I can't put trust in a pagan chick. I'd rather put trust in fiends that lie for crack. Man, I said, I'd rather trust a liar than someone who's just associated with the pagan, yo. That, he's giving you bare quotables. I don't think t -way ever goes a song without giving you quotables. Like, he just gives you bare quotables. I like his delivery in this sequence, though. 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 I wrap this rent in an X5 chase me sav two loaded packs in a back Max for scars and a ride for a bag for a thousand pound he'll die for a rap Cats call back cause the grease is bad Cats call back cause they know it's raw Got hit and they ain't never jumped in the sea but them niggas been overboard My nigga try to take man's lap My man's just swimming yo Fumes know what he's doing with making these memeable moments out of his plugged ins He got T-Way like, doing this swimming motion like, T-Way isn't the kind of person that shows a lot of personality in his videos Like there's people like T-Way, Abs Compared to somebody like Let's say V9 and Unknown T, who like they show, or even Digga D, who just show mad personality versus again, like people like T Way and Abs, who they kind of they just give you kind of stoic, kind of kind of demeanor. So when he gives you things like that, you have to recognize it because it's just so much fun. Like you don't really get those kind of moments out of T Way. Back for a thousand pound, he'll die for a rap. Cats call back because the grease is bad. Cats call back because they know it's raw. Got hit and they ain't never jumped in the sea, but them niggas been overboard. My nigga. Try to take man's life and they're staying inside like COVID laws. Remember me, H, I sweep up county cat circle till we know it's more. 323 over there, man's twinning like Zach and Cody, we made a killing. Little man should have done RB. Them boy rap good, but they're always singing. Free and cool. T way, T way, T way. T bomber clap wave. Niggas been overboard, my nigga. Try to take man's life and they're staying inside like COVID laws. Remember me, H, I sweep up county cat circle till we know it's more. 323 over there, man's twinning like Zach and Cody, we made a killing. Little man should have done RB. Them boy rap good, but they're always singing. 3 and 10 just don't stop swinging that pagan boy, never know what hit him. Left, be in the deep end, I saw my life, he was back still swimming. Then it's shit, cause they're holding feelings. S in the T with cats and flat. Yo, the way you know, he's, he's making a, a lot of C references. I clocked that. He, I think he made one a little bit early on. He made the, the reference early when he did the actual motion. Talking about the swimming. Obviously, we know you're not talking about swimming in water, but. Singing, 3 m 10 just don't stop swinging that pagan boy, never know what hit him. Flip, be in the deep end, I saw my life, he was back still swimming. Then this shit, cause they hold him feelings. That's in the tea with cats and flies. And I can't wait till they bust them gates, no J in the cage, trying to s man's like, Big 4 4, way too ratchet, give it to bro, don't call my kind. Half that block, best clap for the NHS, cause they brought them back to life. I don't know why he does that when he and he flows the uh, 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 like he just creates this really dragged out thing like he does it in a lot of songs that's the reason why I didn't like Mona Lisa I didn't like the hook in the Mona Lisa Mona Lisa like that kind of I don't know why he does that like I feel like for somebody who's been rapping as long as he has now some of these kinds of moments in his flow that aren't that airtight I don't know I feel like I don't know I feel like he just shouldn't be doing that anymore like it's like on the one hand, do I just accept it as a part of his style, like what V9 does? On the other hand, do I hold him accountable and say, nah, this really is not it? Like, it's really dialing back from the quality of your music? Yeah, I, I think it's, it's approaching that point now. Like, I, I'm not a fan of the like, Big 4-4, four, four, way too ratchet, give it to bro, don't call my kind. Half that block, best clap for the NHS, because they brought them back to life. Oh, 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 man said clap for the NHS, they brought them back. Like how they were clapping for them during COVID, you no know, thanking them for the. But they brought them back to life. I feel back still swimming. Then this shit, cause they hold them feelings. That's in the tea with cats and flies. And I can't wait till they bust them gates. No J in the cage, trying to s. Man's like, big 4 4, way too ratchet. Give it to bro, don't call man kind. Half that block, best clap for the NHS, cause they brought them back to life. Shout outs to the composers of this beat. Y'all did your thing. Y'all did your thing. Y'all did your thing. So on this channel, we hold the vowels. That means we're getting straight into it. And I, I wasn't disappointed to a degree. This was definitely a very strong return for T-Way. Very strong return. I just want to hear him on General's Corner next. I want to hear him, if you can even get another Mad About Bars, but I definitely want to hear him on General's Corner next. 
I, I have a feeling that one's gonna be dropping pretty soon as well. It has to be. He has to be coming back out with something. It seems like he, he has a, a, a project and he's gonna be like back on these platforms, kind of building up some momentum towards them. So if that's the case, I'm looking forward to that. But I, I enjoyed this. Earlier I said this was definitely gonna be my top five plugged ins. I'm about 100% right now. It's, it's definitely within my top 10 for like my personal preferences. He does not have to deliver everything about him. His style is so memorable to me. It's very unique. His delivery is cold. Although I will say there were a lot of moments in this one where I wasn't so much of a fan of the delivery. Like he has this kind of like stuttery kind of thing that he does sometimes and things where he puts like these long gaps in between syllables. He says things in a way that's almost feeling offbeat, kind of similar to V9, but it works. But I'm, I'm really approaching that point where I don't know if, if it's just wide it off as his style or if it's to say, like, nah, I, I can't take this anymore. Like, really got to switch it up. Like, like the whole segment at the end with regards to him saying, oh, they clapped for the NHS and so they brought him back to life. He probably could have put, like, maybe two or three more words. I was saying it in my head, like, what are some of the words he could have put to fill it in to make it sound a little bit less awkward. It kind of felt like his flow lost a little bit of steam towards the end. While I do have very strong initial impressions about the beats, I do think it's one of those that I can see kind of getting annoying if you're listening to it for the whole way through. I do think that the main melody was kind of jarring a little bit. Kind of reminded me a little bit of it like an alarm or something or like uh like a cell phone ringtone or something like that but i like it because it was unique and it stood out from some of the other beats that i've been getting from plugged in as of late i've been kind of calling out these plugged in type beats that i've been saying where the beats kind of feel very related and similar this one it stands out I like some of the things that they did earlier on. I do wish that maybe the melody wasn't as overpowering. I do wish that maybe there was another melody that kind of switched in towards the end and they kind of did a back and forth thing. I can't remember which plug in this reminded me of, but it was another one where I said I wasn't too much of a fan of the melody. So I think if these beat composers who are watching this, if y'all can do a little bit more with your melodies, switch them up here and there. Right, maybe switch it up towards the middle, so keep the same general structure of the beat, but then switch the melody alone. I don't know, something like that can add an extra bit of flair, so that way the beat doesn't lose its life as you're listening to it, and it kind of keeps you engaged. But other than that, T-Way did what he does lyrically. He gives you those trap stories. He says things in ways that you know it has to come from a real experience. Either that, or his imagination is just hella vivid. People like him, Fizz, Millions, they give you some things that I'm just like, now nah, you had to have lived that. Like, that's just too simple of a thing to say, but still so vivid that nobody else has said it that has to come from real experience. This one gave me a lot of quotables. And t is a very quotable artist, as I already said. I do think that I'm not 100% sure how likely I am to listen to this one again. I don't know, I'm torn. I like the beat, but I also don't like parts of the beat, but I love what t did with this beat. I love some of those really subtle intricacies as to how he goes in and out of certain flows and finding these different parts of the beat to just switch up what he's on. But also at the same time, some of those delivery moments that I just don't really like that much. I don't know. I don't know. This one, I'm very conflicted. I'm very conflicted. It's probably gonna go in like a personal playlist just because it's T-Way. I'm really not sure how much it measures up to some of his other stuff. There's some other songs that I think that while it may not have some of the other elements that this one has, I prefer it for things like the beat and stuff like that. I'm really not sure. But let me know what y'all think about that in the comment section down below, man. I'm looking forward to more music from T-Way. I hope y'all are too. But as always, hang tight for some more reactions. I do got more of those coming for y'all. But until next time, peace.